Hi, my name is Valerie Ebuniwe and I am a content creator, lifestyle blogger, and a bunch of other things that you get to find out soon. <laughs> A typical day in my life, hmm, let me see. So I am an early bird. I usually wake up early in the mornings. Uh, when I wake up, first thing I do is say short prayer, take my phone, try to read my Bible, check emails, social media, in case there's anything I need to attend to, and begin to get ready for work. You got me, baby, I got your back Looking at you, thinking about All of the ways that you know me I can't get enough We got the future burning the past Good and the bad, making it last We are what I want and I want what I already got So a lot of my friends will say that I thrive off activity. So when I have a lot of things to do, I just keep moving. But the truth about what keeps me motivated is just thinking about where I want to be. It's a good thing and it's a bad thing. It's a good thing because, I mean, it, it keeps you wanting to work. It's a bad thing because sometimes you can't focus on what's happening right in front of you. But um, yeah, that's how I stay motivated. Do I have a style icon? <laughs> I wouldn't say like I have a style icon per se, but if it's someone that I like their style, not that I would wear everything they wear, but I just like their style, would be, I really love um, Tammy Otedola of JTO Fashion. I also like um, Song of St Ami Song of Song of Style. I also really like, um, Camila Kohelo, I hope I said that right, because like she's slim, so she has like my body stature, so when she wears things, I feel like they would fit me a lot better. I like Ozino style concert style as well, I think her style is really interesting. And Denola Gray, I really like Denola's style, I feel like he experiments for a guy, and that's cute to see. For strengths, I would say that I am a very like idea-oriented person, so I always come up with things. I'm just like, oh yeah, we should do this, and we should try this, and we should do this, and we should do that. For weaknesses, I would say that, um, okay, not carrying out the ideas per se, but like, okay, so if it's something that, if it's an idea that I cannot carry out just by myself, so getting everybody together, trying to follow up with everybody, like, because I have so many things going on, I kind of like lose track of things sometimes, but I'm working on being much more organized, so yeah. My top five African influencers or black influencers would be number one, Jackie Aina. I really love Jackie. Then number two is Dima Omi. I love, love, love her content. Then number three would be Michelle Ndamase. I do really like her content. Her South African vibe and everything is really interesting. Then number four would be Ricky Thompson. I like that he has crafted a niche for himself this year and it's just really amazing to watch his growth. And then the fifth person would be, oh God, guys, this is hard to choose, but Makeup Shayla, because I don't know, I just like her and her dress. And how do I assemble my team? So uh, first things first is I decide who I want to work with. Um, after I decide who I want to work with, I reach out to them with my ideas or what I'm trying to achieve. Sometimes they mood boards, sometimes, not all the time. And then after that, we decide on locations. And after we decide on locations, I then plan the outfits to go with the locations. And then 
pack up my bags, try on my outfits and go shoot. Most times I do my makeup myself. So it's literally the photographer and me driving around Lagos trying to shoot content. That's it. Hi, my name is Valerie Bunue. I am a content creator and digital marketing strategist, and this is my digital diary. <laughs>